Hey guys, welcome to another showcase today, and this is a showcase of the survival UI system, or maybe it's the coloured box system. So as you can see in this, the system comes with a stamina, which is the orange behind this, the health system, which is the human, which is currently green, and it comes with a food and a thirst, and these all tick down independently and are controlled in a canvas and you can get this on the unity asset store for free today and i will be uploading a youtube video very soon to show you how to create this from scratch so you can see in our test view that you could see that the thirst and hunger tick down over time we can run around with the basic fps controller we can use sprint or we can use the shift key to make the stamina go down we stop sprinting and we gain our stamina back we can press the spacebar to jump and it eats up a bigger amount of stamina and we can take that all the way down and we'll stop sprinting eventually we can have different interactable objects which the red one will do damage to our health as you can see from here the green one will give us health back the blue one here will add some water or thirst back the purple one as can be seen will give us some food and then the last one is for stamina so we can have loads of different interactable objects within the scenes ourselves so we can look at a pickup and we've got a simple script which has a value we can specify by the type and we just need to reference the controller that we've got and i've got one controller which controls what your current health is the maximum health you play is stamina how much it costs to jump the the rate at which your hunger and your thirst drain the damage that you take when both from one of the thirst or the hunger is down and the connections to the different UI components. So in the tutorial, I will show you how to design the UI and script all of the things to control all the things, including editing the first person controller to adding specifics to decreasing stamina and things from there. So you could take this system as far as you need to go and iterate on it. You can give me any advice if you don't like some of the way that the code's written, by all means, be sure to leave me a comment on the video and give me some of the ideas that you have. Be sure if you do like this asset and you download it from the asset store, be sure to give me a positive review on the asset store because it really helps me out and it just advertises across the store to more potential people who like all these assets because it's great to share it with everybody. So be sure to check out my Patreon, my Discord server and all the other free assets on the Unity store. So thanks very much for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe. Cheers.